Hello everyone, and welcome to today's deep dive into the New York Knicks, a team that is redefining toughness and resilience in the NBA. In today's video, we'll explore how against all odds, the Knicks have continued to fight, surprising fans and critics alike with their relentless drive and undeniable spirit. The Constant Vigilance Every game begins with anticipation, a collective breath held by fans across the globe. We ask ourselves, is this the moment the magic ends? This vigilance keeps us on edge, riding the emotional roller coaster that is Nick's fandom. The reality test against the Pacers. On a fateful Wednesday night, facing a determined Indiana Pacers team right after a Game 1 defeat, the Knicks seemed destined for disaster. It was as if the clock had struck midnight, with every expectation of defeat laid bare. The turning point came when Brunson, crucial to the Knicks' play, exited the game early due to a sore foot. The mood shifted from confidence to dread. As he disappeared into the locker room, so did the team's initial vigor. The unexpected turnaround, just when the situation seemed bleak, the return of Brunson in a blue and orange warm-up shirt ignited a flicker of hope among the fans at the Garden. His presence questioned the inevitable. Could the Knicks make a comeback? Initially, it seemed Brunson might just be a decoy, unable to play at his full capacity. But that changed quickly as he and other Knicks started to claw back into the game, challenging every expectation. Brunson's heroic comeback, Getting knocked down on his first basket of the second half, Brunson didn't just get up, he roared back into action, pushing the Knicks forward with a phenomenal scoring spree that saw him dominate the fourth quarter, dramatically shifting the game's momentum. With 35 points in the fourth quarter over two games, and a playoff total that dwarfs even the closest competition, Brunson's performance was nothing short of heroic. Each move he made on the court was a testament to his relentless spirit and unyielding determination to lead his team to victory. His seamless dribbles, sharp cuts, and precise shooting carved through the defense, making each play a critical hit against the Pacers. This wasn't just basketball, it was art. And Brunson was the master artist painting his masterpiece on the grandest stage, under the brightest lights. His heroic efforts not only regained the lead for the Knicks, but also instilled a renewed belief and energy in both his teammates and Knicks fans around the world. Overcoming Injuries The game wasn't just about strategy, it was a survival trial. Injuries piled up, from OG Anunoby's hamstring to the loss of key players like Randall and Robinson earlier in the season. Each loss could have been the knockout blow, yet it wasn't. The supporting cast rises. If there ever was a personification of New York's spirit, it's Josh Hart. More than just numbers, Hart brought energy, hope, and the quintessential New York grit to every game. Dante DiVincenzo and Isaiah Hartenstein weren't just filling in. They were instrumental, delivering performance after performance that kept the Knicks competitive. A fairy tale retold. This isn't just a sports fairy tale. It's a saga of a team that refuses to bow down, a group riding its epic with every game played. The Knicks are not the Cinderella waiting for the stroke of midnight. They are the warriors battling till dawn. The Knicks as a cultural phenomenon, this team, with its backs against the wall, has captured the hearts of not just New Yorkers but basketball fans worldwide. They remind us all of the power of perseverance, the beauty of battling odds, and the glory of overcoming. What we witnessed with the Knicks is not merely good basketball, it's a testament to the human spirit. This team, led by characters like Brunson and Hart, and driven by a city that never sleeps, continues to inspire and challenge the norms of what resilience in sports looks like. Keep watching, keep hoping, and keep supporting, because with the Knicks, the journey is as incredible as the destination. And remember, in New York, the shoes aren't made of glass. They're forged in iron, ready to walk, run, and if need be, stand firm against all odds.